Schoolgirl Tulai Goran was 15 when she vanished. During a summit at the family home, jurors were told her fate was decided, a so-called honour killing. Detectives believe Tulai's body was buried in the garden, then dug up and destroyed without trace. That was ten years ago. A key witness was Tulai's mother, Hanim, persuaded to give evidence against her husband. During the trial, Tulai's mother confronted her husband across the courtroom, pointing to him and shouting, the person who killed her is over there. She believed he got rid of their daughter's body in a crushing machine or he burned it. The Goran family are Turkish Kurds from one of the immigrant communities where honour crime is a growing issue. Tulai's crime was to fall in love with a man twice her age and of a different Muslim sect. Honour crime is a concept police and other agencies are still trying to understand. In the month before Tulai vanished, January 1999, police had four opportunities to help her. On the 5th of December, they were called to the family house after an allegation her father had hit her. Five days later, an uncle took her to their local police station, claiming her boyfriend was pestering her for sex. The next day, Tulai ran away from home and her father reported her missing. She turned up within 15 minutes. On the 14th of December, she was again reported missing, but again turned up. On the 6th of January, Tulai vanished. No one has seen or heard from her since. Police say that today another Tulai would be better protected. Ten years on, they insist, they have a much better understanding of honour crime. Martin Brunt, Sky News, at the Old Bailey.